Holy <laughs> shoot. And the tangerine inside. Can I bite my lemon? <coughs> Is that alcohol? <laughs> Are we... There's a guy there. Okay. Uh, Two and a half road trip later, we're finally at the next destination stop. Goats need cheese. Goats need cheese and use cheese. We use quite local. So cute! It was no easy task to get to Michelle Girard's La Prairie de Eugenie. I mean, hours of driving and plane ticket changes and hotel changes later finally arrived, but it felt like a crime to leave France without trying one of these top three Michelin star restaurants. So why is it so special? I mean, you've seen his restaurant, you've seen the property, it's beautiful, it looks like a palace and it's a gorgeous destination spot, but he's received three Michelin stars since 1977, that's almost 40 years, and he's one of the founders of Nouvelle Cuisine as well as Monsieur Cuisine, which is a slimming cuisine, a lighter fare to French cuisine. And I really had to pinch myself just to see him in his kitchen and see him in his property. And, and then, you know, and then you can stay on the property. Obviously, that's the whole point. And I literally have to sleep for two hours and then drive another two hours to head back to the airport. Again, this is a last minute add on. It's not because I did not want to come to Michelle Girard's restaurant, but because he was kind of out of the way on the little food tour I was doing with my friends. And so glad we made it here. So glad we came to check it off. It is a bucket list item. I've definitely seen more restaurants than I have sleep and actually of France, but I have been here about 10 years ago, but my France is restaurants. It is about the cuisine here. This is the classic. You gotta start here. This has definitely been a trip of a lifetime. If you wanna see a summary of the entire six days of insanity and extreme food obsessive behavior, you can see all my videos of the six days on my Facebook at Follow Me Foodie.